I'm Tim Trotter, and today we're going to cover what the ruler does in GarageBand. It's used to adjust variable control for where your tracks are in the timeline. Let me show you how. So over in GarageBand, you'll notice this long, thin band at the top that basically looks like a ruler. You'll also notice that it's got timestamps at the top, such as 10 seconds and 20 seconds. Now, that helps you line up your different tracks for where they are on the timeline. You can adjust that by going to the slider on the bottom left here. You can adjust that all the way up for fine control here down to milliseconds, or adjust it all the way to the left for really short intervals, such as minutes or seconds. And it's just as easy as that. That's really all the ruler does. Hopefully that helps you out. 